Hi guys, I'm Exact Chaos and welcome back to another episode of Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. So we're finally doing our own uh, power, very limited amounts though, because we're still, I think, importing power um, from the border. Yeah, we are. So even though we're making power, we're still importing power at the same time. There's a few things I want to change in, in here, but I think the first thing that I'm going to have a look at, oh, before we get to that, let's just double check what our, what our numbers are here. So this is the clean ash. It's basically just ash. So this will slowly dissipate over time. So we're at about 42 uh, tons at the moment. Um, and so that will kind of dissipate over time. This, we are still collecting all of this kind of ash over here. Well, this um, this uh, mixed waste over here so that we can, can run that through our separation system. We've got a fair bit of construction waste, about 100 tons, but we'll let it keep running for quite a while. Uh, there's still a lot to go on the metal, and there's still a fair bit to go before we kind of um, uh, fill these up. Uh, why? Ah, okay, 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 okay. Well, what we need to do is, uh, is up our numbers here a little bit, because this guy is practically full at this point, um, and we do need to run these through here and get our construction waste and the likes um, to get through a little bit better. So the next bus should um, drop a few more people off for us um, so we can run through through that a little bit more effectively. It is working full steam, but it's just at 4% due to the fact that uh, there's barely a person in there. Is there anything here that we needed to build? It kind of felt like there was something with an outline here. Anyway, I might have tried something else there a little earlier. Okay, so keep doing that. These guys are just loading pretty slowly. Um, at the moment. And this is the running? No, it's not the running at the moment. We are not full on any of this. So we're micromanaging a little bit at the moment due to predominantly the fact that our power is a little bit um, hamstrung here. Now, we're making a fair bit of money at the moment. Um, and I would like to probably run a little bit more um, of this. So let's speed things along a little bit, get a little bit more money going. And then we'll, uh, what I want to do then is, is uh, redo our our power network. So what we need to do is, yeah, so this is predominantly coming in from there. So this just goes from anywhere to anywhere. So we'll keep that in mind. Um, and I'm kind of thinking, so we're running this, right? We can disconnect. The easiest thing for us to do is disconnect there and spin this around. But if we do that, Right? Um, hmm. Kind of interesting. So we could do, hang on, hang on, hang on. So the easiest thing for us to do, right? Let's just see, do we have power here? We do have people here that is generating power. So what I'm kind of thinking, what kind of stuff is this? This is just a normal, uh, in, in all in, all out kind of situation. So this one can be used to export power. If we if we rejig this thing a little bit. But I also want us to be able to run power that way. Okay, so these are all is inputs on this side, outputs on that side. So let's have a quick look. I've paused the game. I don't have to pause the game until I start to build. So let's have a quick look here. So let's think about how we're going to do this. So we can run imports on this side and the idea would really be that we're going to run exports out that way yeah i don't really mind why do we have oh we've got a split off here ah so we're definitely importing power into this area okay ah okay and we've got a split off over here no we do not we do not. So unless we, so we might end up importing, continuously importing power into this area anyway. Hmm. That's quite an interesting little dilemma that we're dealing with. Unless we split this up. So what we can do. So what do we want? We would like to export power as well as potentially import power. The importing of power. And maybe what we need to do is leave the import um, facility in here. Right, so we continuously are able to import. What I wouldn't mind is we could run the export line through here. 
which will um, allow this one to be powered as well. So if we were to somehow, we can reuse that to bring power this way. But then the idea is really that we would like to turn this one around. But if we wanted to import, we would have to run it around, mm. which is probably something we could do. Okay, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, okay. How's our money? It's reasonable. Our money is reasonable and going up. I don't think this is gonna be too costly for us to do. What's the, what, what is our um, loans looking like? Yeah, pretty realistic actually. I'm almost go down to a million. Uh, certainly we've got tons more that we can borrow if we needed to. Okay, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to um, spin this thing around so that we go the other way. That's okay, we, we know that's not working. Okay, let's, let's do that so we can start exporting this. Okay, pause the game while I quickly um, figure this stuff out. So let's uh, go here. Uh, wait, come on, power, power lines. Let's, uh, let's get rid of that one. And we'll get rid of this one. And I would like to fund the demolition there. And I would like to fund the demolition um, over here, please. Yeah, it's fairly cost effective to do that. I also would like to uh, actually get rid of that one and fund this demolition as well. So if I do that, we should still have power because we're making our own. Then I want to uh, demolish this guy and turn it around, right? I think that's gonna be okay. Let's demolish this office, there we go. And we'll fund it to, to get it done quickly. Luckily all of that's actually working. We'll probably need to just trim back the road a little bit here, just a little something like that and we will fund the demolition of that as well. So get rid of that. We should have power everywhere at the moment. We just don't have a lot of resilience. Now, go back in here, and what we're after is this guy, the high voltage priority switch, flipped around, uh, actually flipped around again, spinned around like that. Okay, so if we were to do this, the only issue is we don't have, we have no capability Okay, let's just think about this. So if we were to do that, we can bring this one in this way and we can export power, which is fine. Just kind of what I'm happy about, right? It doesn't matter how we do that. We can at the same time power all of these facilities, I think. Yeah, it should be reasonably. Yeah, yeah, we should be able to do that. We may have to run things a little differently over here, but then we do not have the ability to power our facilities from the border if we were if we weren't if we wanted to do that unless okay okay you know what there's a little bit more we could do here okay you know what i'm gonna do um we could we could basically bypass it right but then we can't switch it off if we were to do um, the smaller switches, right? If we were to do a switch there and a switch here and we bypass the whole thing so we can run it through, I think that could work. Um, though we wouldn't have the ability to switch it off, would we? We cannot click on one of these things and switch it off. Can we, I do think I've got a split somewhere in here, right? Can we switch this thing off? We cannot, we cannot switch it off, right? So we cannot switch the split off. So there's no way for us to actually do that. We will be bypassing this whole thing. So whether that's the, yeah, whether that's the right thing to do, I don't know. So if we were, hang on, I'm, uh, I'm thinking this thing through as I do it. So what I'm after is I'm after this so that I can load it up. Well, do we actually need to load it up one way or the other way? That is only 10 megawatts and that's even less, right? So what is that? That's, oh, that's 15 and that's 10. Uh -huh. So yeah, we really need to potentially run even more of them. So then I'm kind of wondering, do we remain? 
the import. Do we forget about the import? Let's forget about the import for now. Let's just try and maintain our own power. Let's just try and maintain our own power. So let's do that. Wonder if we can upgrade that thing. Or we could run an extra line, which would be the 10 megawatt over here. That would be the export. Okay. But then... Jeez. Okay, so if we were to change it to here... I'm really struggling to understand what I'm going to do in this thing. So I would like to run it that way, but maybe maybe running it like this could end up being a little bit better for us, but then we'll have to run an extra cable. But we would like to run an extra cable, actually. To be able to make sure that we've got, uh, we can run a full 18 megawatts out to export. If we do that, we could run all three of them in there. And we can run a cable back for export at the 18 megawatt mark. And we could both import and export. But then we would need... Yeah, I'm not sure that it's going to work anyway. I'm not sure that's going to work as a, as a method. To have import and export run through here. Let's just go with this guy. But we still need to, uh, we still need to improve that, right? So we could... We could still run through the 18 megawatt through here. Well, we wouldn't run it through there, would we? Now, yeah, let's just turn it around and get it all done with. Let's just get it all done with. So that's, that's, that's 15 and that's, that's 10. So that's too much, actually. If anything, we need to just run one that way. Maybe not go through a switch here at all. Ah. Oh. Yeah. 10, 10 or 15 plus 10 that's 25 um running that through there okay for the time being what i'm going to do is i'm just going to put it back and we'll come back and fix some more stuff later if we if we feel that's absolutely necessary so let's get that in there and what we'll do is we'll pay for that we'll pay for this we will actually demolish a little more section here sorry i've been a little bit indecisive here let's go back there we'll Pay for uh, the demolition of this guy. Uh, yeah, like so. And then what we're going to do is we're going to actually run it back over that way. Um, so now if I say 10 megawatts, I would like to go in there and in there. And uh, let's open this up and say do that. So it'll do that one. And I'd like to run the 15 megawatt in there. And... We'll just run it in there. So that'll hopefully fix all of these things. Okay. And now what I would like to do is I'm going to say um, connection. Oh, it's actually showing me which connection we're talking about. Connection three is high priority. Input connection three is high priority. That uh, doesn't really matter. So we're going to spin you around. And instead of importing power, you are now going to um, export power, a full 18 megawatts of it. And that should really get us back up and running, right? So we've got 15 megawatts flowing through there because that's the max that this thing can take. And now I can go ahead and switch this one on um, consistently and it can run and generate power whenever it can. And then we'll, uh, we'll, we'll get our imports or our exports going on there. Now, we should be able to power absolutely everything, including all of these, because we will have... Uh, power running over here. So let's just have a look at what's happening with that and make it Okay, so now power is running in there and at the same time it's running out this way again To come and power all of this stuff and well, hopefully that's powering some of it too But yeah, presumably we are now doing a bit of a power export So let's have a quick look here. If we look at our exports, we should start seeing power over here. Good stuff It's not great amounts uh, we have a power problem somewhere. So let's just double check what's going on with our power situation here. Oh, we're seeing some blackouts because... Because why? Not enough workers? Okay, so we do need to just make sure... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Actually, we need to run... Um, 
much higher amounts of workers and otherwise we will be blacking out here. Okay. Um, I think that's okay. Just make sure we've got enough workers coming in here and we need to make sure that we are constantly having enough uh, here. Now, what I wanted to do is see if I can't fill uh, the tank in there at the same time. Uh, so if I were to do this, uh, we could. It's one in multiple outs. Um, so what I thought I'd do, let's go underground. Give me an underground one. I wouldn't mind if at all possible to just do, see about that. Come on, I need to, uh, let's just, yeah, we are struggling with it. This is my problem with uh, the idea of the power here, right? Come on. We just, uh, it's something that works here, please. Come on. It's not, it's not the ideal situation. I just wanted to make sure we, we double up on our... Uh, can we... Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. There we go. That's the one. Let's uh, go ahead and fund that, please. And so presumably that means we'll also now fill this one up. There we go. So both of them will be filled up. And we'll have ample additional oil ready to go. And all we need to do is make sure we constantly have some workers over here to, to make sure that the whole thing is powered. Let's go back in here. This thing does remain powered at the moment and we are exporting. So let's have a look again at how quickly that uh, power is going up. Yeah, actually, that is a, that's a pretty good looking number over there. And it didn't really cost us much in terms of quickly swapping that around. That is excellent. So we are, we're missing power here. Uh, hang on, why? Oh. Why is this not getting priority? So we're not getting the power we want there. Is this generating power? That's not generating power. So all the power is coming through from that side, right? So any extra power is running through here. What I don't quite get is why we're not seeing any power going in this way. Okay, so unfortunately, what I think we'll need to do is uh, run a slightly different cable through here. Okay, so what we'll do is we will uh, quickly fix this problem by, yeah, we'll have to disconnect it like over there. Um, so please pay to get rid of that one. Okay, so I know you're without power at the moment. And now this is a 10 megawatt, right? Yeah, it is a 10 megawatt. So grab me a 10 megawatt. And what we'll do is we'll just um, kind of run it up there. And we'll run it in that way. Okay, so something like that. We'll go ahead and pay for that. And now we'll have a look at, that's the input input output is low priority high priority okay so now we should be powering this much better really come on guys why is it doing that it's just okay forget about it Let's switch this thing off so i can focus on that so that's high priority you should be getting your power Right? All of this should be getting their power. So why on earth is it not getting its power? Why are you getting power? Are you getting power? Stop dra draining all my power. Okay, fine. Let's just trim that down to a reasonable 9 megawatts. Um, and see if we can now get some power coming over here. No? All of this is powered though. And that thing is running. Uh, these things. I am concerned that this stuff just doesn't do what it should be doing. Input connection one. 
Close me out this thing, please. So that's the... That's the lower priority of the two, right? That's just the lower priority of the two. So that's the low priority. You you give it us first. Then you come in from... Oh, you come in from here first. And then you go and get power from that side. Now you get... You go out there last. You go out here first. So really... I don't know why this thing is not... That's looking okay. This is still... I have no idea why why this is such a such a massive issue. We don't need to run 18 megawatts through there, right? This thing can only take 18 mega, 19 megawatts, but we're not coming even close to that. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to rebuild this thing again because this is frustrating me a lot. So these switches definitely seem to be quite painful in what they do okay i don't want to spend ages demolishing them so just let's just pay for all of these demolitions again i thought we were onto something here but unfortunately not quite not quite uh let's just pay for all of that uh with that out of the way i will need to get rid of this guy and i'll have to pay for that again i will get rid of a little section here and I will pay for that as well. And now what we'll do is we're just putting a stock standard switch in there. And that should, honestly, help us um, in achieving what we wanted to achieve here. We're just swapping them out for a normal switch. And that should really be okay. And what we'll do is we will buy all of these things back in again. But there's definitely something funny going on with that. So now we should really be able to... Um, work all of this stuff out so let's get all of that going on and we'll get that section paid for and now I believe our power should be restored yes power is restored over here and over there and we should be exporting um, reasonable amounts of power oh actually that working really well at the moment good okay these lines are actually being utilized that's giving me a reasonable amount, even with just six workers there, which is a good thing. I'm happy to see that. And now we should be generating a fair bit of exports in terms of that power space. Yeah, 3,000. That's okay. It's not, I mean, it's not, no, it's not, it's, not, it's not a major amount, but it's at least helping. It's at least helping us. Okay, there we go. So that's in place. Um, we've got these things set up, uh, though they're missing staff and they're missing goods. So we need to set up the goods here. Just want to have a quick look at what's going on. We do have room for people to move into. Uh, we do need to maybe at some point start construction. Hopefully construction is now um, running again. Yeah, seems okay. What's happening over here? Ooh, this thing is still full. Um, these... How full is this? This thing's full. Ah, cannot export mixed waste. So who's supposed to be exporting the mixed waste for me? Okay, well, let's get another vehicle onto that so we can sort that one out. Are we... We have more vehicles than we need? Let's just have a quick look at the vehicles we've got running over here, right? Okay, so there's one there. Give me... Um, Oh, it's not ideal to, and you can't, ah, oh, you can dump it straight over there. Okay, let's do that. Let's give me, give me one of these vehicles to, 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 to grab one. I'm micromanaging again, unfortunately. Take, uh, take that right there, please, and unload it, right? And then forget about all of the rest of this, right? And then from there, you'll go and pick up the mixed waste here and you'll go and dump the mixed waste over there okay yeah now now that i'm thinking it doesn't really matter okay and then uh make your move to the next one so let's just get um and then i'm gonna try and just redo that a, a few more times so we can empty empty that uh, that out but yeah that should help us out a little bit so let's micromanage a little bit 
everything else is kind of underway. And I'll, I'm just want to, uh, at the same time, I'm going to try and keeping it a little, keep it going a little bit slower now, so that we can we can up our money a little bit and uh, sort out our, um, our our debt. Why are you there? Why? Why? I wanted you to come and directly drop it off over here. But you, oh, okay, that's okay, that's okay. That's fine. Come in over here. Okay, now what I want to do is I'm going to remove you, and I'm going to remove you, and all you do is you'll just go and uh, move this back and forward. So at least we've got some extra capacity and we can keep running. Okay, beautiful. Beautiful. Let's just keep that going. Um, yeah, there's a fair bit of construction waste that can get out of here. If we can just run that one back and forth a few more times, we should be in a reasonable position. I'm assuming this guy is coming to drop some stuff off and then going to do the same thing. I think it's going to come over here and grabbing one. No, where are you going? Fuel. Fuel, that's what you're doing. Cannot export anymore. What's this guy doing? Wow, there's lots of stuff bringing in here. We probably just need to clean this out a little bit quicker. So this other guy coming back here, I might, um, once it's fueled and coming in here, I might have that one run back and forth a few times just to empty this out a little bit. Just so we, we reduce these numbers. This guy is coming to do that, right? Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to um, remove these for a little while. So it just runs back and forth, cleaning this out a little bit. I think that'll help us a little bit more. Good stuff. That'll help, I think. <laughs> Okay, we have a very reasonable population at the moment and a very low unemployment, which I would have loved to see a little bit higher at this point in the game. We are building some roads over here so that we can bring some tourists in because we do now have these hotels ready to go. Uh, we should be pretty good with all of the various items we need. And if I come and have a look over here, uh, we're looking good over there. We're looking good over here. We're exporting a lot of alcohol. And this is starting to drop a little bit. We've got a building on fire, which uh, should be okay. It's got uh, a where, well, it's a main warehouse. Where on earth is my firefighters? Here they come. Here they come. Come on, firefighters. We need you. We need you sorted out. My goodness. Loud motorcycle out in the street. Um, okay, get the firefighters ready to go. Excellent, that's good. All sorted out. Thank you so much, because that would have been a bit disastrous. Our money is really looking pretty good. And I'm hoping we're emptying this thing out. Well, not quite yet. We still have a lot in here. Yeah, we need to get through this a little quicker. We can definitely set up more efficient things in the future. Definitely. Yeah, that number went up a lot. We dumped a lot of stuff in here. It's a little bit in there, and this thing is very, very, very empty. Why is this... What is this one doing? It's picking up... Oh, oh, it's waiting till it's full. Of course, yeah, that's fine. And then it's just going to dump it over there. Yeah, that's fine. Super duper happy with that. Just burning it, selling it, reusing the power, selling the power, what have you. Very keen to see where we end at the end of December. Our exports is pretty good. Our imports weren't too bad. Yeah, we're definitely getting a getting a good number. January, if we don't do if we don't spend money in January, we should be in a very good spot. Then we can start thinking about the rest. Oh, we haven't had a look, but we probably should be doing some stuff over here. So pollution filters, television study, hmm, television study maybe. Renewables. Ah, I wanted to do some other stuff too, and advanced engineering. Let's uh, let's have a bit of a look at a a renewable study. See how that works for us. Add a lot of people to that mix. And over here, what are we doing? Te television campaigns. Let's do a foreign pipeline connection. Absolutely. Let's get that done. Lickety split. Okay. Now, one of the things I thought we could do is we could start exporting dollars directly over here somewhere. Uh, let's have a look at what's going on. Now, I would like to not... So, if we go... Oh, look at that. If we were to do... A direct pipeline connection if I build a pipeline connection over here and I'm assuming a pipeline connection needs to be powered right but if I were to build a pipeline connection right over here 
build some renewables with a pipeline connection um, directly here, we can generate, uh, we won't generate a lot, right? So if we come and have a look at this, uh, the export price for oil, crude oil is what I'm after. Well, directly like that. Um, so they will buy dollar. Uh, yeah, that's not too bad, but we can make much more if we were to do fuel and bitumen, right? Bitumen into dollars, $300 a barrel. Uh, or, a, or a ton. So that's that's not bad. That's not bad at all. But but it'll be a, a big investment. So I'd rather see about utilizing some of this. So let's um, make that a little smaller. And what we can do is we can, we are still running at full speed. Yeah, at the moment, everybody's happy. Everybody's healthy. Um, government loyalty is in a good spot. Um, money is coming in very well. We've got an electricity problem somewhere. Uh, we'll go back and have a look whether we really do. Uh, it might just be people, uh, people issues. Okay, now if we were to grab some oil jacks, oh my, it's one very small little spot right here, and we can't get it to be okay. So if I were to do like a forty percenter right there. Really? Wow. Okay, well, let's, um, let's demolish that one. Try it again. Don't pause it. Let's just try it again. So if we were to do a 35% somewhere over here, okay, and we were to do a 35% somewhere over there, There we go. Well, that's about a, as good as we can get it. And then what we'll do is we'll grab ourselves a little pump station. And I'd rather do use one of these, to be honest. So we'll do something like this, right? Forget about the rest of this. Actually, we'll we'll do it a little bit like that. Quite happy to do something like that. And then, uh, oh, we're still working on the um, on the piping connection. Do that side on, are we not? Uh, foreign pipe connection. Ah, research. So we still need to do the research here, but that's the plan. That we'll kind of get this in place. Um, maybe we'll flip that around so we've got, yeah. Yeah, so we'll try and do this, right? Oh, that's going to be beautiful. And and then and then we need some renewable energy over here. Now, the one thing we don't have is fire fighting action. So I do wonder, and pump jacks do catch fire. Oh, look at this. Look at this. This is looking absolutely brilliant. We may think about some foreign resources over there to man a fire station. Okay? That's something that we may think about. So then that will start working on our dollars because our dollars is not um, looking where we would like it to be. A little bit of foreign manpower to just man a fire station, a small one, I think is going to be all that we need. So let's actually, let's go and plan out that, that piece. We also want to bring in tourists, so let's let's fly on over this way. Let's uh, let's clear out what we've got in terms of messages. I do like my little road here through the hills. So let's get a fire station in there too. Let's do that. So let's. Um, so what I would need? Oh, and we would need a. Mm, if we were to do this. don't actually need that to be um so let's just do maybe a gravel road a gravel road might be better that's us a gravel road yeah up to here it can be our border road tie these in here at the same time i'd like to start planning out uh, and what i'll do is i will um say uh get it done because nothing will come and build it over here it's way too far away so i'm not pausing right stop pausing uh, now, let's see. The next thing we need is will be a fire station. So I want a tiny little fire station. Anything smaller? We definitely have a smaller one. Let's go here for the modded ones. Fire station. I'll do fire station. 
three, six, four, four. Really? Is that it? Fire. Ah, here we go. Fire station, two words. Two vehicles. There's the one. That's a, a tiny little one. Seven, two, six. These are small too, but maybe... Rural, rural with four? That just doesn't seem quite right to me. I want the lowest number of workers there. 30, 50, 50, 30. So this is the one. So let's right click it. We'll get it onto favorites. So at least we have it available. And that's kind of our smallest fire station option there. So that's our two vehicle fire station. I'm going to tie that in. Yeah, around here somewhere. Okay, we'll do that. We will at the same time do, uh, oh, you know what? We can do a reasonable one here. We don't do the, need to do the free um, fuel station, but the free fuel station, yeah, let's just do the free fuel station, to be honest. We've got plenty of them. This is not going to be a highly used one, so we'll do something like that. And we'll have a look at what kind of renewable energy we can we can run here instead of, uh, because if we run distribution lines all the way here, it's going to be super costly. So what we'll do is we'll get all of that built. We'll get a little bus just a little micro bus to run back and forth with some, some some workers here and we'll need to get the pipe connection in there so that's all good now it's almost the end of january we haven't spent anything significantly Ten thousand on imports uh let's have a look at what that ten thousand looks like in terms of imports now chemicals meat and liquid fertilizer that is pretty good that is pretty good this road is under construction okay Seeing a little bit more unemployment, which is a good thing. And hopefully our numbers of people are going up. Oh, look at our productivity, guys. 106% are loving it. Loving it. Average lifespan, 83. Unemployment is low. And we've got plenty of educated workers, basic education and better education than that. We've got an electricity problem. But let's see over here. I don't necessarily think that's a general electricity problem, unless this one, that only, ah, it only gets its power over there. It's not, it's not properly powered, that's why it's giving me that message. So don't worry about that too much. Now, back to this, the population is what I'm after, really. So what does our population look like? Oh, here we go. It's a bit of a slow, uh, bit of a slow growth, really, this year last year yeah and we did bring in some people but yeah at least we've got a reasonable birth rate so if we go to this month yeah we're, we're doing we're doing a reasonable job at, in terms of that we're doubling um well we're doing more births than we're doing death so we're, we're growing um ultimately and our money oh, look at how spectacular our money is starting to look look at that that's awesome if i can pay off I'm, i'll definitely pay off a little bit more of my loan Reduce that number. I think that's exactly what I'm after. So let's go. Well, let's get to the end of January and then we'll see what our position looks like and we'll go from there. This should be filling up. Oh, it's nice and filled. This should be... It's still not empty? Wow, we are struggling. Though at least we've got a little bit of room. Yeah not getting these things emptied out in a reasonable in a reasonable time frame are we that oh this thing oh no this isn't empty either wow how's this going getting there getting there we do need to start having a bit of a look at whether we can can improve that uh, or or, uh, or reuse some of that make maybe create a bit of steel um, that would be good if we can start sorting that out How's this going? Renewable study is almost done. And the Western Connection is moving, but uh, not quite as quickly as I would like. Let's up our, our workers here and get this to move a little bit quicker, really. I'd rather we get this done a little quicker. This one... Yeah, I think we're okay. Yeah, this, is, this can be done now. So we'll move on to the next piece. Excellent. So now that's in, out of the way, the next one I would like to do is let's do the wind power plants project. See about how we can use wind power on that side, because I think wind is probably going to be our easiest option. It's the one that's not, doesn't have to be manned. 
These guys have everything they need, uh, including a few people without jobs. Hang on. Can you make it there? You cannot make it there. Ah. Okay, so that's certainly a bit of a big deal for us. That you can't make it all the way there. Hmm. It's not the end of the world, though, but we've got too many that's not going to be able to make it there, right? Oh, that one can make it there. Well, then this has to be very close. <clears throat> uh, once January is done, I'll quickly do the upgrade here. I just want to make this one as clean as possible in terms of income. Look at that. Look at that. I'm going to pause it now at the end of January. Once it hits the 1st of February, I'm going to pause it and we're going to have a look at that. That is good numbers, guys. Really good numbers. Loving it. No, we're uh, we're self-sustainable. We're self-sustaining now. Uh, not everything. We'll slowly have to build up even more and more. Okay, pause it there. Now, there we go. I'm pausing it. Let's have a quick look at our snapshot for last month. So last month, we exported 190,000 rubles worth of goods, right? That is 70,000 in bitumen, almost 50,000 in fuel, almost 50,000, well, maybe 45,000 in clothing. 11,000 in alcohol, 10,000 in food, and 6,000 in power. That is a really good. That, that looks really good. If we go back out and we say, what did we import? Chemicals only, meat and fertilizer. That is exactly what I would like to see. We don't make any of those, so we have to import them. There could have been uh, electronics import here as well. We need to import electronics from time to time. But that's really the kind of stuff I, I'm aiming to see here. During construction, we'll see some more stuff. The fact that we don't see any food, the fact that we don't see any any other bits and pieces here is very good. Mm -hmm. Good. Now, so what we can work on is if we can do a chemical plant, though we don't have the workers for it, that might be useful. The other thing we can do is start working on meat. Meat I've started putting in there, but it is a the gain we get from meat is, is not great. So... We'll see about that. We'll see about that. But I think we can start working on meat, but meat will take more workers, which is workers we don't have. So we're going to kind of hold it there, I think, for the time being. We are doing our own compost, which, um, which at least offsets it a little bit, I think, but we're still going to import that. But at least these numbers are so manageable, it's not even funny. Okay, now if we go into the rest of this, we paid, we reduced our loan balance by 20,000 and our loan interest was only 5,000? Is that, that can't be right, right? Because if we have a look at the loan, we're paying 20K. Uh, oh, okay, we are paying 20K. But if we go back here, you can see um, five of that was paid towards interest and 20 was paid towards the loan balance. Yeah, I don't, I don't quite get it. I don't quite get it. But anyway, what I want to do now is certainly pay back a lot more of it. We've got 400k, we're going to pay back 200 now. So if I hit, it, hit that and I say, give me an extra 200k, we'll return some more money there. So that should um, reduce that payment even more. So we're going to be even better off now. I'm happy to say that. That's awesome. That is awesome. So now, uh, once the wind study is done, we'll have a look at what we can do in terms of our oil exports so that we can get some dollars. Hopefully we'll get that done soon. Uh, we also need this thing done before we can get there, but that will be done soon too, I believe. Excellent. Uh, oh, and now the other thing that I wanted to do was actually go ahead and upgrade this tad. Uh, so can I please... Uh, forget about that. Let's do this one and that one. And uh, please pay for that and please pay for that. There we go. So now, can you now get all the way there? Oh, still not. Where's this fire? Over here? Yeah, we're going to be fine. So you still can't get there. Now, what we can do is we can probably run a little pathway down this way, which I think is not the worst plan. Oh. So if we do that and pay for it, and now, can you get there now? You can. Excellent. That's good. Okay, what can we do to make this area look a little bit nicer? I also want, oh, hang on. Did we, just want to have a look. Um, some of these, um, I thought they said we're going to see some better um, gates. But I'm not seeing them yet. So maybe they're not in yet, just yet. 
If I go over here and have a look at, oh, actually, it's probably in this area. Yeah, so just fence gates here. I wouldn't mind fencing some of these things off a little bit. Ah, uh, okay, so the power, I could reduce the power exports a little bit because I think we're, look at this, this bothers me. Because this guy, let's go, we'll come back and have a look at this. Please notify me if this is empty because that'll be devastating. Um, okay, 1,700 is where it's kind of holding. Or is it going down slightly? Yeah, it's slightly going down. I'm going to export a little bit less power, one megawatt less. And hopefully that means it'll come back up again. So we're just doing a little bit more than we probably should at the moment. And I think I know where this one is. Yeah, that's fine. I'm going to drop it down another megawatt. Ooh, it's a little bit more than a megawatt. But anyway... The money that's coming in from that is not worth us risking or running out of oil for. So we'll uh, we'll keep that in mind. This is still struggling to keep pace. And these guys are filling up. Filling up nicely so that once we have critical mass here, we can start creating some facilities that will actually generate some, some stuff for us. Uh, and this is filling up nicely, to be honest. But it is ash and it is dissipating. So what? Why? Why? Why, why, why? Who, who's, who's dropping here? Who's dropping stuff in here? That's fine. Why are you having stuff in here? Biological, burnable, other waste. So there's some other waste in there? No. Cannot be. What's coming here? Waste reclamation, nothing. And then we've got the two. Yeah, that's that's all that's actually coming here. That is weird. So is there something in there that we couldn't separate? Don't know, but that seems to be a bit of a challenge for us then. Right, why do we all of a sudden have... Why would we have burnable waste in here? I'm super silly. I am super, super silly. I need, oh my goodness, this is the mistake that I made. These guys need to go to that facility. Give me, give me, give me this one, please. Please don't come here. This is not where I need you to go. I need you to go to, from there, come there and unload it. Oh, that was a big mistake. What a silly maneuver. Silly, silly, silly. Let's fix the other one as well. That was just not right. Oh, man. You guys must have been screaming at me in the comments. That is not good. Anyway. So, that is some of the stuff that you need to figure out as you play with this. It's just, it's just not right. Okay. So, now we'll stop doing that. So, hopefully... Uh, we'll have more ash, and hopefully once we close this out, we'll have some stuff that we can run through again. We could, yeah, we should be able to run the stuff through through there. Research program finished. Excellent. Is that the... Oh, no, that's this one. What is this? OPEC. Expected research duration. Yes. Negotiations to make our republic as member of OPEC organization of the petroleum exporting countries. This will make the exporting, uh, this will make that exporting oil will have less affection to the price and we will sell the oil at a higher price. That is the plan. So that will be important for our next step of our journey. So let's, uh, let's get moving on, op on joining OPEC. So now we can do the pipeline thing on the other side. So let's start planning out our pipeline. Do we have other oil? Let's uh, let's let's uh, let's move on over here. So we do have another bit of an oil reserve just a little further away. So we could probably pump that in there as well. But this will be our starting point, right? This will be our starting point. We can. Ooh, you know what we can do? We can certainly uh, at least start with some of these things. Right. So let's get that going. That's pretty good then we're not pausing, right? We're not. Uh, now we can do the oil export. Right over here, we'll flip it around. 
got a traffic jam. I'm pretty sure I know where that is. So that's the idea. I'm gonna plant it there. That's our oil. Uh, what I'll do is I will run this one in here and we will go ahead and pay for that to do, 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 get that done. We still don't have, uh, what I can do is I can probably pay for this because now we might start seeing some stuff. What I'll get our, um, our distribution office to do is bring fuel on over this way, even though it'll take a while. Ooh, you know what? Let's just have a quick look here. Where would be the center of this thing? Um, so if we've got fuel there, probably around here somewhere we'll need fuel as well. So let's go over here and find ourselves a spot for some fuel right here. Bring it in a little closer because as we bring in buses, we'll need to do the same thing. So let's close this one out and uh, we can we can we can run the game. We'll get ourselves a little bit of a section in there and we will. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not what I'm after. I'm after this for that please and make sure we don't do that yeah good now i want the the free one again give me another free option here yep happy with that and what we'll do is we will go ahead and build that section as well now we do need to bring in um the fuel we've got a research program done which i believe was the we'll come back to that in a minute this is our local fuel distribution. It's not with powered, but that's okay. We don't need it to be powered. Uh, you will be bringing fuel over here. Let's pause it while we quickly sort that out. Uh, I want you to go up to about 60 there. And we'll also go here. Now, I think this should be sufficient in terms of fueling some things. What I will do is now let's wait till we get some fuel in there and we'll go from there. Uh, let's, uh, and then we'll get ourselves a fire station or a fire truck. You will then need to get some other stuff moving as well. Here we go. This, how's this going? Yeah, we're, uh, we're progressing actually. It's being paved at the moment. Uh, we should have a fair bit of workers available. I'm loving it. Now, you should have finished. Oh no, OPEX underway. So yes, now that's done. So let's go, do we do the, let's go advanced engineering or do we do solar? Now, I think advanced engineering or TV study. Now, let's just go advanced engineering for the time being. I think that's uh, it's appropriate. And now we will have wind power. So the idea would be that we get some wind power over there. But let's just get our fuel sorted first. Did we have a truck here that could do it? Ooh, I'm, I think I'm missing a bit of a vehicle here. Let's grab another vehicle. It's probably the right thing to do is just grab... Uh, give me two more. I don't want anything to run out of fuel. That'll be kind of devastating for us. Our money is still looking really good. February is not as rose-colored as, as January, but we kind of held off on some stuff. That's good. Uh, these guys should have plenty to still export. Actually, this is growing quite substantially now, and this is still dropping. It is still dropping, but so slow. No, it is definitely still dropping. Yeah, so the idea is I should maybe drop that down back to about 100. So we don't need that many more. We are exporting at a reasonable rate. Yeah, this one. I would like that one to stop telling me it's got a problem. Is there a way I can switch that off? Please do not uh, notify me of power issues here. I cannot cannot actually do that I would love to be able to turn off specific notifications for the specific facility so that's something that might be cool in the game I saw there's a mod that changes the UI which I thought looked really good but I don't really want to kind of mess around with it but um, but it certainly looked quite good hmm okay have we managed you fill any fuel in here? We have. And I think that's the fuel that's going to go all the way out this way. Now, that is something that I do wonder. I think it'll be sufficient, right? I think it'll be sufficient.
I think we'll have enough fuel. Uh, it'll be empty. Wonder if it'll fill itself up. And how much does it actually take? Second like drive on this guy. And let's do that. This is a drive through the countryside. Uh, it's probably going to take ages though. But it is looking pretty good here. Lots of big trees around. But I do love the hills. The hills are is awesome. And I, I'm happy that uh, we built this road in a pretty reasonable spot. It's a pretty slow truck this. So we're not going to... We're not going to see this out to the end. Um, it just, it just, it's just not quite right. So it needs to get all the way there. Hopefully it'll get there and not um, stop the whole fuel thing. At least this one worked. So that section is good enough. Once this is done, we'll start running in some tourists as well. That's going to be the next big thing. I can probably start um, uh, getting these things loaded up. That's a track builder. Uh, 60 40 yeah good now local this is imports this is local distribution these vehicles are all out doing their thing so i need to be a little cautious about that we could use both because this one is not doing anything right um the Mosky Road Cargo Station. So I'm just going to do the same thing here. Because it seems that one's tapped out. So do that. Load over there. Um, and then bring here and there. Okay. And what we'll need to do is we'll need a covered hull. And uh, grab me a, a covered hull. I'm going to grab one of those. And we need a refrigerator as well. Duk, duk, duk. Uh, probably the six tons is a little bit much. I'd rather do that. So let's just get that going. So now it will go and fill these places. And so it's basically, this is, ex uh, this is, this is the most, the Morsky local distribution. And this is the Morsky local distribution too. Uh, Tur Morsky local distribution. You. Save it. And uh oh. oh 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 so hang on. We just said that was just say, saying local I put the wrong one. Uh rename no the transparent there. This is um this is lo local to local two. Right? There we go. Nice. Local one, local two, the Molski local distribution, and we'll rename this building the Molski local distribution two perfect okay so that's going so these should now be filling up with the various things that it needs food meat alcohol all those kind of good stuff and then we'll open up for staff once we uh once we have some buses in place that can bring some tourists in that should hopefully help us out a little bit back to about three hundred thousand. Oh, a good number on the last month there now we should see there it goes let's see so it's dropped stuff off so it filled itself up over there and it's got plenty plenty oh no this might be second one yeah what oh yeah yeah yeah. it's it did a drop off and now it's going to do a, a bitumen move or something like something to that effect okay so here we go um now we should have fuel ready here we do Good stuff. Let's uh, let's get ourselves a, a vehicle. Just the best we can get. It's this one. So we'll buy one of them. That gives us twenty three workers that we need. I want to buy a I want to buy a small little micro bus to to import some foreign workers in terms of dollars. So that's really the plan there. To bring workers there so we don't lose any buildings. So give me this guy. I want a little bus, a little micro bus. As cheap as we can get. There we go. Give me one of those. Ooh, that's a nice, uh, that's a nice locomotive there. And what I would like you to do is come all the way over here, flying around. We're at the end of this episode. I just want to set this up, and then we'll end the episode. So you will come and load uh, workers for me, please. Nothing else, right? 
and we're not unloading. And you'll come here and you will unload workers for me. That's it. And make a start. That is fine. You've got everything you need. Good. So we'll we'll bring that in. Now we get some let's get some um let's quickly get this stuff done. So we would like to run uh that one there. And that one there. Oh, that's gonna look really cool. That's gonna look really cool. And uh let's go ahead and get that built. And we'll also go ahead and get all of this built. And now the idea is, can I please get us some renewable power here? Want a big, nice big one. Ah, oh, we don't need... We don't need to power the... Um, that one. Okay. Well, let's get it in there. That seems pretty reasonable. And this needs to export, please. Does it need more? Do I need another wind power? Probably do. Its production is pretty low. So let's get an extra one just to make sure. But that should be running up a little bit now. Yeah, yeah, we've got the workers, but we need a we need an extra we need an extra one of these guys just to make sure that we're doing a reasonable job here. And get another in place. I believe this one should also do... Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, it's being... Oh, it's building. Operating without issues. Yeah, wind speed. It seems okay. Okay, there we go. Now we're starting to make a little bit of dollars. I'm hoping it'll... It'll be sufficient over time to because it's a it's a it's a very um, a very minor little little piece here. I, I don't know what these guys cost us to build, but uh, but they should be running. And uh, ooh, what did we? Where's my um my micro station? My 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 my, my micro bus micro station. Where's my little micro bus? Really? It's not here yet? What? It, um... That's a... That's a little concerning. We should have foreign workers here, no problem. Where's my bus? It's coming. It's definitely somewhere. It's on its way. It's driving. It's maybe just still on its way. Oh, there it comes. Beautiful. Okay, we should have our first load of foreign workers. But then what did we pay for? What was the import cost? Oh, I think we imported something into this facility. Yeah, I think that's what's happened. I think that's what's happened. New vehicle available. That's fine. Anyway, there we go. Slowly, this number will come back up. It's not going to be, it's not going to be a big deal. Uh, this is struggling a little bit now with the power, but that's okay. Okay, so now let's see the foreign workers. That's the issue. Ninety-five bucks on that one, and this should give me like seven. Yeah, that's okay. So at least now we'll have firefighting um, stuff here. Yeah, just go straight in there, right? Straight in there. And once the OPEC study is done, we'll have we'll be fine. There we go, guys. So we've got our exports going. Just want to check up on our um on our on our um, on our research very quickly. And in the next episode, we'll probably add some foreign tourists to the mix. What cost us a lot of money here? Imports was why is that import so high? Hang on. Let's just have a quick look at the imports. Wow, what is this? Steel? 177 tons of steel? Jeez. Okay, so that's uh, that was a pricey, a pricey endeavor for us there. Uh, the next one is ooh, advanced engineering, pollution filters. Uh, let's go with 
the television study for now. And OPEC still underway. OPEC still underway. Okay, guys, I'm going to leave it there. Thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed it, please hit that like button. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.